Hey guys, it's Apple Farms here, and these are my top 5 must have free Mac apps. Today we'll be talking about my, in my opinion, the top five must-have free Mac apps. Okay, so uh, the first one would definitely be Perian, because Perian is this uh, QuickTime plugin which allows you to. To play uh, videos like an FLV format or whatever on QuickTime, I'll have to down the download link in the description. Okay, right now I'm just gonna go on YouTube and download a video in FLV, and then I'll play it in QuickTime to show you guys. I'll just do. Christina Grimmy ET Okay. Hey guys, I'm gonna be singing E T Maggie by K <laughs> So I'm just gonna download this. And this is a plugin for Google Chrome in case you're wondering. Let's download this. Um, Okay, so while we're waiting for it to be done, um, I'll talk about my second must-have Mac application, which is Wine Bottler. Wine Bottler is this application that allows you to to play uh, to to open .exe files on your Mac. Okay, so. I have this, I downloaded it off of YouTube just now, it's a key gen for Sony Vegas, which I'm not actually going to be using, but I'm just going to show you guys. I will click it, and wait for it to load, it takes some time to load, so we gotta wait for that. Okay, then the third one would be Caffeine. Caffeine is an app which you can download from the App Store. And what it does is that it keeps the computer, your Mac, awake. So if you click on the toolbar here and click on Caffeine, and then you see there's the Steam thing coming up, it's activated. Okay, there you go. It's the playing it yet. It's annoying. Then, once the steam comes out, then uh, that means that the computer will not sleep until you turn it off. So it's convenient when you're watching movies or anything. Yeah. Okay. Then the next one is Evernote. Evernote is an application where which you can just um type quick quick notes you can sync it with your iPhone or your Blackberry I'm not sure if they have it for Android but I think they do so you have all this stuff okay, and then the last one would be doc library doc library is this application where you can go and change your doc team what you do is that you go to leopardocs.com go to browse all docs er. ok 
Okay, then you're just gonna download one of them. Um, go with something more obvious. I think maybe I'll do um, rainbow. I don't know. I'm just gonna do that. So it's gonna download. And don't unzip the file when it's done. Uh, this application does it automatically, but I'm just gonna move it to trash. Uh, because I need the the non dot flb no the the dot zip file. My mind isn't working well. Okay. No idea what that thing was. Forgot the name. Rainbow, right? Okay. A really bad memory. Rainbow, something other rainbow. Okay. Then you want to go to dot library and import rainbow reflective dot zip. Open it. Then you have it here, and then you can just click on, uh, click on it, and then click activate. And then. You will have your dot changed. See, so I like rainbowish and stuff. Then, if you want to change it back, just go to your default dot, click on it, and activate. And you have your default dot back. It's the easiest way to change your dot without having to deal with codes. Okay, so. The other YouTube video which we downloaded, Christina Grimley singing ET, amazing singer. Go check out her YouTube page, Zelda Love, Zelda X Love sixty four. Then you can just put yeah, it as an FLB. ET so yeah, then it's able to play dot FLB files now. So I hope you enjoyed this video. All the links for all this um. All these applications are in the description. So I'll see you next time. Bye!